Gonna have me some fun, gonna have me some fun. Justina, Justina, Marley would be so proud, wouldn't he? But so would Caradoc. Carrick's still worried about Justina. Guy just hasn't been the same since she took out his girl. We all miss Patrika. Hey, come on! New stripper tonight, Latino Spies. Something new for you old bastards. Hey, wait. Hundreds of years have gone by and you guys are all still fucking pigs. Baby. No. Radika, are you sure you're ready for this? I guess we'll find out. Oh, no! 
Mystica! Caradoc has risen! Check on them as you asked. The girl. She killed them, Carrick. All of them. You are certain of this? I saw the bodies. The heads. She hunts us one by one. This would never have happened if the Master were still here. I am a disgrace to his memory. Eric, no. I'm a loyal soldier. I exist to serve. If only he were still here. But he is not. Willem cannot be here today, but he has asked me to speak on his behalf. Some of you know, he has been through things that do not need to be spoken of in the house of God. I am here today to talk about redemption of the soul, if you will listen. The angel, which redeemed me from all evil, Bless the lads, and let my name be named on them, and the name of my fathers, Abraham and Isaac. And let them grow into a multitude in the midst of the earth. Genesis 48, 16. Time to begin, is it, sweet Rodica? If I am to rest, it will be here in my homeland, where it all began. Bogdan. Father Bogdan. Welcome, my lady. I was actually expecting my old friend Willem. He told me that. I know what he told you. He's here. In me. Hi. I understand. Now it's final wish to me. The game to make Cleansing of the body. Redemption of the spirit. Is it now for you? Rodika with me. What do I need to do? You must open your mind. And your spirit. I want you to understand, as your Willem could not, Rodika. I want you to see through my eyes. I only want to understand the evil that corrupted the man that I loved. The Balkans are ours, my Sultana. The Karamanides, Venice, no longer a problem. What of Constantinople, my Sultan? Many in our empires grow restless after abandoning your last incursion. It will fall, yes, I have seen it in dreams, in vision. How about situations in Hungary, in Romania? If they are to restart their foolish infidels crusade, we cannot abide it. That, beloved, is not so clear. What, what is this? What, what am I seeing? I was 11 when I watched my father get drafted by the great white knight of the Christians. John Hanyandi. If I only knew he was to be my father's undoing. It is agreed then, my friend. The Crusades against the Ottomans must be renewed. 
This is King Ladislas's will. You know I am a member of the Order of the Dragon Hanade. I will not stand in the way of the Christian cause. Sultan Murad and his Turk will find their Allah at the tips of a luckier sword. Await my courier. Listen to all of that, did you, my son? A great day dawns for Christianity in Wallachia. One day, this crusade we wage will all fall to you. What troubles you? I, I fear I'll never be strong like you, father. You are the son of Vlad the Great. You cannot show weakness. Never. Yeah. In order to rise above, young Vlad, you must learn to embrace the darkness. You must, in order to show true conquest. Ah, my first meeting with your beloved. You have his quickening now, same as mine. Do you remember it? Speak, knave, while you can. Please. Your father and Merkia died for the highest cause. What you and your brother went through with the Turks, I cannot fathom. Oh, but you will. Yes, you will. I recall the coldness in Willem's bones when he discovered the heir of Romania's Vlad the Devil was an immortal. You were taken prisoner by the Turk. Oh, my brother Radu and I were given to the Sultan by my father to save himself. Expecting us to be executed, neither were we executed, nor did it succeed in saving his life. That prince seemed to have taken an interest in Radu. The worst part? He would come to welcome it. On your knees before Sultan Murat. I said kneel! You are scaring them, dear. Welcome, children of Darakol, to Agrigos. You might find that here. We do think somewhat differently that you are accustomed. Enjoy. Enjoy our Turkish hospitality then. The church offers you now a very great honor, child. Do you understand that? I do. Very well. The lad Dracula III you are hereby inducted into the Order of the Dragon, charged with striking down all heretics of Christianity and crusading against the infidel Turks. Are you prepared for this task? I am, by the power of our Lord Jesus Christ and the Holy Saint and the Martyr Saint George. Aguam mezecora est Deu. The lad Dracula III you are hereby inducted into the Holy Order of the Dragon in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. May your legacy be just and great, so as to match the righteous fire you will unleash upon the Turk. Oh, yes. Go with God then, Vlad. Please, sire. Please, can you spare a few ducats? Please, I'll surely starve. Then you will starve. My love, stay with me. Stay with us. This empire is lost without your guidance and your leadership. We are in Wasal. <coughs> the Kaziglo Bay. <coughs> the Kaziglo Bay? The Lord Impaler? What does it mean, Musultan? Only the ravings of a sick man, Mara. The new Sultan will not be heeding them. My first love, my wife, Elisa. It all seems 
so bittersweet now. She was beautiful. Our union was the calm before the storm. in Transylvania, I stormed Turgovist. I engaged and killed the betrayer, Vladislav II, my first conquest. If you say so. You're not half the man your father was. And he was a coward. <laughs> And now you are dead, Boyer Pista. I became Prince of Wallachia as my father before me. Prince Vlad the Third, son of Vlad the Great, sovereign ruler of Ungro Wallachia and of the duchies of Amlas and Fagaras was the title granted. Did you want a cookie? Here it comes. With princes of Wallachia being murdered from within by the dozen every few years, I knew I had to form a personal elite guard I could trust. So I formed the Armas. Doran, Angus, Grip, Carrick. Patrika, Isabel, must be. Quite the motley crew. I should know. Aye, does he know? He has no idea.
Prince Vlad Dracula. Caradoc. What's the difference? To his people, he was immortal even before he was an immortal. <laughs> you know, Nakata, you're not even funny. This quarantine is really starting to get to you, isn't it? Mm -hmm. uh, I was just getting in the mood, that's all, you know, Dracula, scary, gives me the heebie-jeebies. He wasn't a damn vampire. Vlad's origins are actually pretty interesting, though, if you'd care to pay a little attention. Well, yeah, don't let me be a party pooper, because I do care a lot about Caradoc. Care a lot. Caradoc. Okay? I need a break. I want my stimulus check now! Be upstairs. 